Welcome to the JSC's Market Data Policy Guide. Our policies are designed to help market professionals and data distributors understand the use of each policy, emphasize the applicability thereof, and enhance the compliance with the regulations pertaining to the use and distribution of our market data. There are five documents which make up your agreement with the JSE. And they are JSE Data Agreement or Indices Data Agreement, the Product and Services Form, the Market Data Policies or the Indices Market Data Policies, the JDA, which is the JSE Data Agreements, or IDA, which is the Indices Data Agreement, as well as Related Price List. Finally, there might be technical documents if applicable. In this session, I will be covering multi-use policy. We will cover the multi-use license, the reporting license, the conditions, examples, and the fees for the reporting license. We'll cover the composite licenses, the examples, as well as the fees. In this license, it allows a customer in the normal course of business to make an insubstantial amount of FTSE JSE indices data available to their existing and or prospective clients in the form of a report, marketing material, or publication in hard copy and or online. The index data used in the report could be obtained from the live, delayed, and or end-of-day indices data service. Reporting license conditions. Data use is incidental to the primary purpose of the report. The report contains insubstantial FTSE JSE data. No constituents data other than constituent names may be incorporated in any report. Not applicable to contracted users who have an existing end-of-day indices distribution license. Examples of reports include, but are not limited to, performance report, broker research papers, fund fact sheets, investor promotional materials, etc. Fields include, but are not limited to, change of index value, index name, etc. Reporting licenses examples. Here we have a fact sheet of ABC Fund, which shows its launch date, the benchmark index that's in use, which is the FTSE JSE, capped strix, as well as the ISIN for the fund. Composite License A composite license is applicable to customers that wish to create a composite index in-house or use a designated calculation agent by blending FTSE JSE indices with other indices for internal use. Customers must be licensed for the underlying FTSE JSE indices before they can be granted a composite license. Example, in order to use FTSE JSE core indices constituents data, to calculate a composite index, the customer will need to subscribe to the FTSE JSE core indices designated end user, constituents and tracker data fees. An example of a composite license over here, where we're showing the benchmark as 40% of the FTSE JSE kept all share and 15% of the MSCI all world countries total return index as well as 40% of the STEFI index to create a composite license. Thank you. For more information, please email mdclients at jsc.co.za.